Oops. And that is only 20% of my sheet music. In this video I will show you how to replace your paper sheet music with an iPad. We will cover the following topics. What kind of app you need, what tablet you need, how to use the app, what kind of foot pedal and what kind of music stand you should have. This is Vornatello and my name is Vasily Gerasimets. Before we start, I wanted to say to you guys, do not hesitate to write any questions in the comments. I am really here to help you. And please don't forget to like this video and hit the bell to Vornatello to show me that this video was helpful and you want to see more interesting content soon. Okay, let's begin. I've been using my iPad for reading sheet music since 2014. It is super practical, I have never regretted switching to a digital version of SCORE. Maybe you still question yourself, should I use an iPad instead of normal printed sheet music? I just can say you, it's totally worth it. By the way, if you wonder whether it's a sponsored video or not, it really isn't, obviously. That's why there will be only my personal recommendations. What kind of app you need? There are many different apps out there, but not any of them can compete with Fourscore. In my opinion, it's the best app for reading digital scores. I've been using it since 2014 and I have never had any problems. It has all the necessary tools you need. I will not go too much into detail. You can find more information online. Fourscore costs around $20, but it's worth every penny and you just have to buy it once. What tablet do you need? Well, in this case you have only one possibility to use an iPad. Fourscore is compatible only with Apple. There's no Android version yet, unfortunately. Actually, from my point of view, an iPad is anyway the best choice. For example, my iPad is from 2014, so nearly seven years old in this moment and it still works great. About the size, if you have the money, buy the big one, the iPad Pro. If you don't, this size also works great for me. Here. Except you are a pianist. How to use the app. How to get your sheet music into Fourscore. Often you cannot find the right sheet music online. There are still many sheet music not available. But that's not an issue at all. You can just take pictures of your sheet music and convert them into a PDF document. Or just directly use the function in Fourscore. I would not recommend to use a scanner. It is just so much easier and faster to take a picture with your iPad. I also recommend to convert your pictures to black and white so that you can better read and edit them later. For example, when you want to change a note head or don't like the dynamics written by a composer, you can easily change it then in Fourscore. Backup. What is also very important that you should do regular backups of your library in Fourscore. Because you will lose all your data in case your iPad is stolen or just lost. To do a backup you can connect your iPad with your computer and use iTunes or even better use Dropbox or any other cloud service. Then you will be able to use all your sheet music from everywhere even if your iPad is not with you for any reason because uh, you can then just easily print your sheet music. What kind of foot pedal you need? I've tested many different pedals and the page turner pedal from a company called Donna um, is the best in my personal opinion. You can find an Amazon link in the description. This pedal, by the way, is even the cheapest as far as I know at the moment. But just in general, the most important thing about all page turner foot pedals is that you have to feel that you really push the button. Yeah, maybe you can see this. So that you can use the pedal without looking at it. Keep it in mind when choosing a foot pedal. What kind of music stand you need? First, you need a special holder for your iPad. It can look like this. Mine is from Graffiti. It is already old and I'm not sure that they still sell this kind of case. 
but I believe you can find some good alternatives. Secondly, you need an iPad stand. I have built my stand by myself. Here you see it. Because the problem is you will not find light where it stands for iPads. Usually they are rather heavy, but if the weight doesn't matter for you, just buy any iPad stand you like online. If you want to know how to build this kind of iPad stand by yourself, let me know in the comments, then I will make a video about it. You will be surprised how easy it is. So guys, I think that's it. I hope I really could help you somehow. Please don't forget to hit that bell. There will be many cool videos soon. Thanks for watching. This was Vasily Gerasmets of Wonder Cello. See you next time.